Introducing first, the challenger, led by his manager, Bobby the Brain Heenan, from Grenoble in the French Alps, weighing 520 pounds, the eighth wonder of the world, Andre the Giant. This is undoubtedly one of the greatest Intercontinental Championship matches in the history of Saturday night's main event. Well, you're right, and Andre the Giant is one of the greatest threats to the Ultimate Warrior's reign, both literally and figuratively. His opponent, from Ports Unknown, weighing 280 pounds, the Intercontinental Champion, the Ultimate Warrior! Have you ever seen anybody head to the ring with this kind of exuberance, this kind of enthusiasm? The bad blood between Andre the Giant and the Ultimate Warrior traces all the way back to August when Bobby Heenan lured in an unsuspecting warrior only to be attacked from behind by Andre the Giant. Well, it was a well-orchestrated plan on behalf of the brain and his end goal, bring the Intercontinental Championship back to the Heenan family. Of course, the Ultimate Warrior is vowed to never lose the Intercontinental Championship. Something has to give here tonight. You hear how his leg connected? King, we return to pay-per-view next month when WWE presents No Holds Barred, the match, the movie. And I, for one, cannot wait to see that film again. I couldn't agree more, Cole. And I guess you could call it life-imitating art. But now we have Hulk Hogan and Seuss at odds here in WWE. And their white-hot rivalry has taken to a new level a few days ago at Survivor Series when Zeus unleashed a savage attack on the Hulkster. An attack so brutal that the referee had no choice but to disqualify Zeus. Yeah, you're right. It's almost as if Zeus doesn't know the rules or, quite frankly, doesn't care about the rules. He just wants to inflict pain. What a huge move. Oh, man, is he fired up? What makes a man even want to take a gamble like that, Ken? How should I know? I'm scared of heights. Oh, ow! He's still not through. Andre the Giant undoubtedly looking for revenge here after Ultimate Warrior led his team to victory over the Heenan family at Survivor Series just a few days ago. And surprisingly, Andre the Giant had very little to do with the outcome of that match. You got that right, King. In fact, Andre the Giant was the first superstar eliminated after being counted out less than a minute into the matchup. And of course, in the end, it was Warrior standing tall as the sole survivor after he defeated Bobby the Brain Heenan, of all people. He's enjoying this. Oh, wait, nice reversal. And it's Andre the Giant able to break free. Oh. The Ultimate Warrior says he will chop Andre the Giant down to size, just like Jack did in Jack of the Beanstalk. No, but this is no fairy tale, King. And Andre the Giant is over seven feet tall and weighs in at over 500 pounds. Yeah, you're right. If Warrior's not careful, he may find himself faced with a cold, hard reality that Andre is not your average. And Warrior is taking it to Andre here. Warrior! Whoa! Trying to knock the big man down. He He's showing no fear in the Giant. Andre knocked right outside of the ring, and now here comes the Warrior to continue this beatdown. I mean, King, how can you not be impressed with the Warrior? What do you mean? I am impressed. I think the world is impressed with the Ultimate Warrior right now. He's got the Giant, Andre the Giant, in big trouble right here. Bobby Heenan, he can't believe it. Well, Bobby Heenan better find a way to get that giant back in the ring. I don't like how slow he is to react right now. Two. Oh, there it is. He didn't need a GPS to find the mark. Two. Hey, look at this. Andre 
the Giant doing some good work here. And he gets escorted back through the ropes. Ultimate Warrior finds a way out. Look at that! Oh, whoa! Andre the Giant goes down! A concerned look on the face of Bobby Heenan as yeah. Warrior continues. Oh, look at this. Andre missed the Warrior. And... Whoa, huge close up. Andre's in trouble. Andre's caught up in the ropes. You got to know the Ultimate Warrior's going to take advantage of this situation. And here comes Warrior. Oh, oh man, he uh -oh. runs right into a big boot from Andre. A giant boot from Andre. Warriors hurt. It is. And at Bobby Heenan, he tried a cheap shot there, but the Warrior caught him. Oh. That's it. This is what everyone's been waiting for. Bobby Heenan finally getting his at the end of Ultimate, at the hands of the Ultimate Warrior. Now, Heenan and the Giant outside the ring. It almost looks like winning the title was a the secondary plan here. As a result of a disqualification, and still Intercontinental Champion, the Ultimate Warrior. And it looks like Andre the Giant's attempt at winning the WWE Go again seems to come up short. No pun intended.